Let's go to uh, Manic by Halsey, not Maniac, because I can speak English this time. Uh, 16 songs, 47 minutes long. It's uh, like a minute shorter than the um, been, Circles that, album, which is like, yeah. a, it's, it's a good... This is, like, this, this week was... This is a sweet spot a of sweet albums. spot of albums, exactly. So we didn't get overwhelmed, you could actually sit here and listen. I started last one, so you start this one, go. Sure. Um, it is pop that I actually really like. It's mm-hmm. not anti-pop so much as it's radical as Billie Hal- Eilish, but... Hal- Halsey is one of those pop artists where her first album was not poppy like that much her second album was kind of more into it so i didn't like it as much but this one is a blend of the two yeah i i I, I halsey i'm pretty sure you're the first person who like mentioned halsey to me and you're probably like liking her music to some extent but this is like definitely a good mix of it all it's a good because like it starts totally differently than it gets to like Mm -hmm. once you get to graveyard graveyard just feels like this weird sort of really aggressive mix um, that goes with it, but I really like it. It's, it's really banging. And then going through that, Forever is a Long Time, which is really like powerful piano ballad. Mm, it's a beautiful feel the song. Um, I really I, like I, I that song. I knew you would like that. Yeah. That and I, I, and I hate everybody because of it. it's actually, I don't really like the beat too much if I hate everybody, but it's the lyrics of it that are fantastic. It's powerful. Of course you like that song. It, not, not even because of it, because it's not even about that, like the title. This, Fair. Uh, but yeah. it's the lyrics of her saying, I don't need anybody else, or something along the lines of that. I, I don't and need anybody else, ex- I need everybody. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And it, it's a very powerful album from her. I, I actually quite enjoyed it. And it's, it was something that I didn't think I was going to enjoy as much going into it, because I was kind of on the fence, because her previous works were a little hit and miss. Her first stuff I liked a lot, but this was actually very good, top to bottom. Um, towards the bottom... I didn't like Killing Boys and um, uh, those two little interludes were kind of dragged on a bit until you got to more, which was a good song and still learning. Yeah. Uh, but so I could have done without those a little bit, but I see what she was trying to do. Um, but There's overall, range I like album. it. But it's definitely it, it, just a lot. The, pro- the production was very good. That's yes. the, all three of these albums. The production is fantastic. Yeah. It, which even is good for a change. The, the production, I will say, for all three of these albums was focused. Um, yes. And then news were, n- news where it was going. going. Yeah, um, every album, all these three albums all have a theme and they stuck to that theme. They didn't really stray too far away from e- it. E- I even, say. I will say this album, the interludes were really great and like I oh, liked they were them. Good. They were really purposeful. They were longer, they're usually longer than a minute other than the first one. And yeah. they like were beats onto them, um, mm-hmm. like songs onto their own. And they're definitely good bridges for the um, way the album plays together. Because I'd accidentally played um, a couple of the albums we reviewed too. Um, on shuffle the first time. Oh yeah, totally this fucked up the experience. This this I had to al- listen. I had to start. No, this all. album is actually one of those you, especially the second half of the album, you really can't listen on shuffle because it doesn't. It wouldn't make sense. Yeah, um, and that's kind of my only gripe with it is it's very linear. It's it, there's not too much you can do except outside of how it's written. But other than that, I think it's fantastic. It's, it's, it's the guardrails of pop, really. But yeah, a, a really good album. Um, I'm gonna say this is that same thing, but instead of like going right past the puck you pick up the puck with your hands and throw it in and the goal is just so dumbfounded that it goes in <laughs> <laughs> and, and and the ref haven't gotten a fresh hundo it's just like uh, score <laughs> i'm so down you know i want it i want this to be that but the ref comes over with the money gun and says score <laughs> and just raining hundo, hundos on the bench shoot the puck out of the money the gun. Puck out the money gun there we go that's what it is he grabs a money gun he's he's still skating so technically it's legal puts it in the money gun and shoots the money gun and scores <laughs> That's what this is. That's why oh, I love Jesus. arbitrary. Sc- that's why I wanted a wild arbitrary scale. One that makes absolutely no sense. Coming into 2020 quite hot. Exactly.